Hey guys, welcome to today's tutorial. Uh, we're gonna be making this text and screen onions kitchen. Alright, let's get right to it. Alright, so first off, we're gonna type in the text onions and scale it up a little. Okay, that's okay. And next up, we're gonna change the font. Killing slant. I'm gonna leave a link in the description so you can use it also. Then next up, I'm gonna bring that all down a little. So I'll click on the shape tool and just click on that small black dot over there. And okay, bring it down a little to increase satisfied with it. To, okay, I think we're good with that. Alright, so next, I'm gonna convert it to a call, right click, then I make a duplicate. Then, so I have, after converting the call, I have to continue the right side. The next up, the one on top, I'm gonna fill it with white. And I'm gonna select the one and then there's a black one which you can see there. And I'm gonna go to effect yeah. and I'm gonna press contour. So what contour does it it, it adds um kind of like outline of different thicknesses thickness sorry um to the called object or text. So I'm gonna press apply, go to the settings in my and I'm gonna have that all right next i'm gonna convert that effect together the one that's a black one selected i'm gonna beat my puts like a picture and i'm gonna convert it back to a call something like an index i go to put trace and we have this so basically what this does is that it converts the um, the bitmap object into a call that we can feel. So I'm going to delete the bitmap. So I'm going to double click on the right angle to, to create the box around the page better. And I'm going to fill it with that green. Okay, take it with the outline. I feel the green. Then we can go. And next, I'm just gonna select the text. That's the black one, the black color. And if you feel the really lighter shade of that same color, uh, which I already have on my color palette. Good. Alright, then I'm gonna go and zoom. Alright. Then next, we're gonna add. Drop shadow and first on the white one, so I'm gonna select the white one and drop shadow. So I said drop shadow and just drag from the center, little away from the center, and we have that. Then just change the federal to two, okay, and I'm gonna like it not so much. Then we do the same thing for the other call. Select it and click on the drop shadow and do the same thing. Just drag it from the center to the top. Then I'm gonna use the feather into two. Okay. And that then I think uh, looking good. Then next I'm gonna add another image layer. Yeah, 
texture I use. Right, so tons of grease can um, what I'm to do when you put it sparkly inside the box so right drag into the lid. Just leave it so those are the options I'll clip inside. Voila. So we have this looking good. So bring in let's put in text I mean it's kitchen. So kitchen then we can bold and we can write. Let's change the font. So we're gonna use um, okay. Looks this is good. So we need to sign. To, to stretch it out a little bit. I think that's okay. Okay, then I'm going to move it to the center. I'm going to do the size of the center. Move it over to the center. Thumbs up, and I'll definitely make one. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to give a like, subscribe, and catch you in the next one. Peace.